sides. In three, two, one. Up. And right away at the start of the match, all six robots are on their way. Beach City is taking control of the blue switch, and Red has control as well. But neither Alliance placing a cube on the scale yet. Looks like 330 is going to attempt. It doesn't quite stay on them. So as we move into teleoperated, each Alliance has control of a switch. Neither has the scale yet, but they're racing to get Three through a nine, coming right back with one for Red. Scales going back and forth, and with about a minute 30 left in the match, Red has a narrow lead of just 10 points. Ninety-four approaching their own rung. They have about 12 seconds left to climb. Looks like 3309 is trying to go up. 4619 falls off, but they attempt again. Over on blue, 294 has latched on to the scale. Will they have time to pull up? No! As we reach the end of the match. Four ranking points in that match, and Blue, although they lost, did get one. Now, we're going to hand it off to RSN for, some, for a closer look at that match. A lot of smart plays there by the Red Alliance, coming away with the win and uh, all of their RP. Steve, tell us a little bit about that match. Red had an opportunity right at the end. It looked like they were going to do a buddy climb immediately, but they had to go back down and resettle. They had that much time to be able to resettle because... 3309 took control of the scale early and kept it throughout. Uh, they, they themselves went for the switch auto, ensuring that they would get that uh, auto quest ranking point, and then had enough confidence to take the scale by themselves. Yeah, all around smooth play in that match there, Steve. Um, I, that's the sort of play that I hope we're going to see the rest of this event from all the teams. Let's take a look at...